What is up guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to do something different. I'm going to be playing the first ever tricking game. Yeah, if you guys want to go follow the guy who created this game on Instagram, his Instagram is going to be in the top right corner of the screen. Go give him a follow, he posts a bunch of stuff about updates and other things like that and like new tricks that's going to come out. Just an idea of how many tricks are actually in this game. Here's the list of all the tricks. And then some of the credits of like people that help build the game and stuff too, but like these are all tricks. Every single one of these are a trick. That's crazy. I don't have all of them memorized. I have a, some of them. Yeah, this game has free mode, game of trick, and game of add-on. I, if I have time, I'll show you both of those too. So let's go into free mode for now. Okay, once you spawn in, you have the option to do a tutorial. I've already done it, so I'm not gonna do that right now, but if you guys play this game, you can go through the tutorial, and it teaches you like some basics, like backflips and like tricking stuff. But I've already done it, so I'm gonna skip that for now. Yeah, this is kind of where you spawn in. You spawn in on this like platform thing that's like made out of concrete. But I'm gonna drop down to here just to kind of like show you what this game is kind of about, and then I'll go check that stuff out in a minute. The little circle in the bottom right corner, that is what my analog stick is doing. So if you watch that, that's kind of what my controller is doing. Switch scanner, you just pull down. If I wanted to do depth cork, that's the motion of a depth cork. Same thing with single and like triple corks. I don't think I did that right. I'll do one, two, three real quick. And then you can do that all the way up to quad cork. I don't know if you'll ever add like quaint cork. That might be just too much. But you can do anything from a backflip to triple full. Um, scoot trip. Another thing you can do in this game that's really cool is this. Boom! My very own character that I made. He don't have my hair, but I did the best I could. Let's see if I can do this real quick. Oh, the back, oh! Here, this is, here's another really cool one. Double full in. So, it is not the most realistic game in the world, but it's still really cool though. Cause you can do that stuff from like back handspring, uh, like back handsprings and stuff. Or round off. Wait, good. Let me try that again. Okay. I The controls are really weird. I'm still trying to get used to them. Once you get the hang of it, it's really good. But there's so many cool tricks in this game that you can actually do. Let's see here. What else can I do? I'm going to do a TDR trip cork. Okay, wait, wait. I have a, I have a cool trick in mind. I'm going to do TDR. Oh, nope. Okay, I'm gonna do TDR. I forgot to cork. Okay. TDR, uh, cork, hyper. Oh, wait, wait. You can, you can also click down the right analog stick to make it slow-mo. Do that real quick so I can actually do this combo. Okay, so TDR, cork, hyper, to scoot, trip, yeah! And then you can replay that too in normal speeds. This is what it actually looks like. Pretty, pretty nice. I think it's pretty nice. A lot here. I'll head over to this section real quick. There is a little bit of parkour in the game right now. It's not perfect, but it's in the game. I think the developer is working on adding more to it. Oh no. That's... That's not what I wanted. Yeah. Oh, no. I was hoping to land that. Can I, I'm gonna try to do something. I'm gonna try to cork off of this. Oh, okay, wait, I gotta get closer. Okay, cork off of this. Can I, I don't, okay, I don't think I can cork that gap, but let me do it here. Yeah, that's... Let me hit a quick quad. Nope, not... The, oh, no. But, this game's not perfect, like I said earlier. There are... The, oh, no. Ow, that hurts me to watch. Oh, I still want to hit a quad fork off this. There it is. To front roll. I would have back rolled out of that, I guess, but I don't know. So I already did double full in earlier. Okay. I, I'm gonna show you just normal full in, because I haven't done that yet. You can do uh, full outs. 
Uh, full, full, which is full, full. Okay, full, full is actually really hard to get in this game. Oh, there it is. Can I do like back up to full, full? There we go. Okay, maybe I'll do them on the ground. It's less realistic on the ground, but I like you can actually see the flip better. Can I do dub full? I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try dub full to dub back. Oh, that's so close. Full out. There we go. I love how, like, halfway through the flip, he actually does like, the whole arm throw thing, like, kind of how I do it too, and most people do. Okay, I already did full, full, I did full out, full in. Uh. Oh, here's another one. Miller. It's tucked Miller, but. And on here it says double full in, uh. Double full in full. It should. But it's just a Miller. And then you can do the exact same thing where it's full in, double full out. I believe, which is super hard for me to actually get for some reason. But yeah guys, that's basically the tricking game. I should probably mention it. it's called Tricking Zero. It's available on Steam and Xbox currently. I think he's working on getting it on PlayStation soon. And also, it's currently free. So if you wanna play this, it's free on Xbox and Steam. So go get it if you have either a PC or Xbox. So I'm gonna end the video right here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Did make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Turn on post notifications and if it's an upload, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.